This head lettuce has been hand packed in boxes in the field and transported here for vacuum cooling. Once inside the vacuum chamber, the lettuce is subjected to a lower air pressure, a pressure at which some of the water in it will turn into vapor. Heat is thus removed from the lettuce by the latent heat of vaporization. Since the process happens quickly, only about 5% of the water in the lettuce is lost. The boxes must be ventilated to allow heat to escape. The cooling process is carefully controlled and monitored to ensure a uniform product. The vacuum cooling process allows the head to be cooled uniformly throughout, while ice will cool only the outside of the head. Large forklifts, designed for the purpose, transport the cooled lettuce to a cold storage room. What effect does the weight of the boxes have on the amount that may be moved by a single forklift? These large pallets of lettuce can be cooled in the vacuum chamber in 20 to 30 minutes. Lettuce is removed from these older style coolers and loaded directly onto refrigerated railroad cars for shipment. The lettuce, which is nearly 95% water, is very perishable and must be moved rapidly to the point of sale. After being harvested by machine, the potatoes are hauled in bulk into the processing plant. Here they are moved into the plant in a manner similar to tomatoes, that is, by a series of flumes and conveyors. The water in the flumes, combined with an overhead spray, provides the initial removal of soil and debris. As the potatoes enter the plant, they are hand graded. Damaged potatoes are removed. The plant itself is a complex of sizing and sorting conveyors and belts. The potatoes will receive a number of inspections to ensure quality control.
These sizing rollers automatically grade the potatoes, transferring them to belts where they are moved toward a final inspection before packaging. As more and more crops are mechanically harvested, a requirement for breeding is resistance to bruising. Though the potato is relatively firm, it is still possible to suffer loss through bruising during the packing process. The lower grades, often for restaurant use, are packed in 50-pound burlap sacks. The porous cloth allows for gas exchange. It is important to keep the relative humidity at 85 to 95 percent to avoid loss of moisture, which will cause shriveling. The better grades are packed in 10-pound paper sacks, weighed and automatically sewn shut. A mesh window in each bag provides for the gas exchange in this package. The harvested and packed potatoes can be stored at 40 degrees Fahrenheit for two weeks or longer.